How are we doing everyone and welcome to the latest vlog. Now you join me somewhere very special indeed. We're up here at the Manor Fishery on a South Coast Rods social with some of our ambassadors. This weekend we've got myself and Stuart. We're fishing down here with Wayne Mansford, Ryan Need, Rupert Whiteman and Rick Willits. And we've got this lake booked out on a lake exclusive for the whole weekend. Now, this lake is very close to my heart actually because I learned to fish about half a mile up the road when I was six years old and I've come back down to booked on with Justin and his team here at the fishery and we've got the whole lake to ourselves for the weekend. Now stock wise this lake holds around about 150 to 200 fish, all different strains, immaculate looking fish most of the fish range in from sort of 15 pounds up to 30 pounds however there is one very special fish inside this lake and that fish is a fully or a very heavily scaled mirror that's going over 60 pounds so we're here this weekend to catch up have some fun catch some fish but we're in search of the big fully so keep those fingers crossed let's see how we get on this weekend and see if we can catch that huge great big 60 pound fully scaled Well, it's about six o'clock in the morning on our first morning. Uh, we got down, got the rods out sort of yesterday evening. And we had an eventful last night. Um, Stu's just playing a fish there, over on the other side. Um, I unfortunately lost one, um, just about 10 yards out. It wasn't the big bully. So, uh, you know, I'm gutted I didn't get my chance to have a photo with it, but um, it wasn't the big girl. But Wayne round to my left, he's had three fish. He's had two just under 20 and uh, a 29.14. And Ryan had a, a double figure common as well. So um, how many bites is that? Three, four, five, uh, five bites, I think. Uh, no, actually three, four, five, six bites with Stu's over there. So uh, not bad for the first night. The fish are definitely feeding and they're responding to the bait. There you go, Stu's just put it in the net. Oh, the fish has just popped its head up around, uh, around my left hand side, around the snag bush. So uh, yeah, things are looking good. There we go, it's seven o'clock in the morning on Saturday morning. So we've done one full night. How many is that, Wayne? Uh, fish number four. Fish number four for Wayne. I think we've had uh, seven or eight bites around the lake so far, so it's all going good. Real nice, scaly one, this one. Not the biggest fish in the world, but can't grumble. Well done, Wayne. There we go, 29.14. Biggest one for my first night on the manor. Stunning fish that one, well done Wayne mate. Cheers G. Nice chestnut mirror. Where's that big girl? That's it, yeah. Go and get the big girl feeding. Right, well that's a good uh, good result for the first night mate. But uh, twice the size next time please. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful Wayne.
go 31 pound common for Wayne. Fish number five, I think. Absolute cracker. Tail. Yeah, beautiful one, mate. Yeah, nice little thing. See his becks, how small they are. Oh, yeah. yeah isn't he? And that's a uh, 31, is it, right? 31, four, mate. Excellent. Yeah, you've got a nice little spot going there, haven't you? It's all coming together. I think that's the 10th fish. Uh, might even be the 11th fish, but uh, it's been banked. Yeah, excellent, mate. Let's grab some steels and we'll slip it back. How big was that one, Wayne? Uh, 23 pound. 23 pound, absolutely pristine that one. Well done, mate. Get some steals, and it's still only Saturday evening, isn't it? Yeah, early Saturday evening. It's probably only been out about 24 hours. Fish number seven. Fish number seven. Happy Still days. Time for that big girl yet. Indeed, mate, indeed. And action. And action. There we go, over the moon with this one. Little perfect common. My first fish that I've banked. Have a great time up here at the Manor Fishery. It uh, truly is a special lake, this one. Never not quite sure what's going to come along. I think we've had two, two 30 pound uh, commons, 29 mirrors, loads of 20s, doubles. There's still a chance of the big boy coming along as well. So I'll slip this one back, get the rods done for the night, and hopefully the big footy will turn up later. Right, it's Sunday morning and uh, got this lovely little common here. I think we've had over 20 fish now, 21 fish, something like that. And uh, the big big boy hasn't turned up yet, the big fully. But it's still plenty of time because we've got this place booked out until first thing Monday morning. The way the bookings work on this one is you can book it, private bookings throughout the week, lake exclusives. And then you also can book it on the weekends as well, which is like Friday morning through till Monday morning. So we've got another night. And uh, yeah, it's been brilliant fishing. This one here, I don't know if she's gonna let me hold her up. She's a bit lively. Oh, I'm still boy. Come on. It's that time of year, springtime, where they're full of energy and beans, these fish as well. Come on. And this one is a, let me get this hold up like that. There you go. Beautiful uh, common there from Manor. Nice dark crystal clear water here. Oh, I think that's all she's going to let us have, uh, have on camera. So we'll get this one slipped back. Go and see if we can catch his brother or sister. Biggins don't move, turn that quick, do they? No. You've had enough of them, so you said. I have. <laughs> Not over here. 
I think it'll be 50, I think we have them on it. 53. 52, isn't it? 53 something. What the one you had on my rod? Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Rocked up for a barbie. Yeah. <laughs> Secret Cambridgeshire pit. It's like 50, got covered in fucking goo when I went there. I don't know. It's been 20 years. Yeah. Nice way, well done mate. Fish number 10 I think isn't it? Yeah, number 10 now. Just lost one on the left hand rod, but the right hand rod's uh, been pretty productive. Seven bites on that one. Here's number 7 on the right hand rod. Happy days mate, happy days. Nice one Wayne, just a tad under 29 I think. 28-14, fish number 12. Fish number 12. Taking on the left hand rod, just about three wraps out Buff. on the margin. Show Good us, little battle. Show us how it's done mate, doing well. Skills. Going into the final night, way with a 34.6, absolute stunner that one. Real big head, big set of fish. So it is first thing Monday morning, it's around about 5.30 in the morning, it's just started to get light. Uh, last night, a little bit of a quieter night. We still managed, I think, uh, four bites between us, maybe five bites. We're well over 30 fish now for the weekend. It's been an unbelievable weekend. But I've got to tell you this about, uh, well, just as it was getting first light, Ryan had a take, he's playing a fishing, and he put up a little shout. He's like, get in there. Went round there. He's got a big fully in the net. It's not the massive fully but this is a very big fully, 37 pound 10. Um, didn't even know there was a fully that big in this lake, apart from the, the huge one. Um, absolutely buzzing for Ryan. It's, it's made for the perfect end to this trip. Well, the perfect end would be catching that 60, but uh, you know, it means that we've got to come back and get that one next year, which we definitely will do. But it's been a wonderful time here at the manor. I'm going to end this video by just a few outtakes of the uh, the 37 pound fully. But thank you very much to Justin and all the team here at the Manor Fishery over. So they've been great hosts. Um, it really is a very well run fishery. I recommend it highly to anyone out there to try and to book on. I believe bookings for next year come uh, open on in September. So look out for that on their website. But uh, yeah, for now I shall say goodbye and I'll leave you with these outtakes from the big 37 pound 10 fully caught by that man, Ryan Need. Take care guys.